Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're talking about facing your year. These nine tips for life are to help you to improve your life, to help you throughout your walk through the year. I wanted to walk with you this couple of weeks to encourage you to keep up with, with your year resolutions, to keep up with your goals, to keep up going and not giving up just when you're beginning because it gets tough guys and it gets rough. So I wanted to be a help to help you out to do your best and improve to be the best you that you can be. Tip number one is facing your year. 2017, we have 365 days, 52 weeks, and 12 months, guys. But don't panic, don't panic. I know that seems like, wow, things are flying quick, but don't worry, guys. This is what I'm here for, to help you out so that you can succeed this year in reaching your goals. Let's start. So there's two things, two, not four, sorry, two. Two things that I want to point out that are major things that can hold you back from reaching your goal this year. So we wanna face this year head on, so let's do it. So the two things that I wanna talk about are this. Number one, first, becoming stagnant. The second one is competing against others. So let's go on to the first one. The first one is becoming stagnant. Now, one of the things that I've seen in the past years, even with me and my own experience, has been that as I start my year or as I start anything, I start fired up. I start like with all that I have and I go full on and hardcore. And when I go hardcore, I don't realize that I just went from being here to here and I quickly become stagnant in where I'm at and everything just becomes repetition. I keep on doing the same thing over and over again without noticing that there is no growth in reaching my goal. So I become stagnant. So how can we stop from being stagnant and how can we see those things before that happen? Well, this is how you can prevent it and this is how you can see it before it happens. When you set your goals up, even right now, it doesn't matter where you're at, start where you're at and make goals that are higher than the goals that you made prior to that goal. So if you made a goal of running one mile a day, then next week run two miles. And then the third week run three miles. And then the following week one run four miles. And then the fifth week run five miles. And do you reach a higher intensity than what you thought you could reach. And that is by slowly elevating yourself to that goal of running five miles. That is a way of preventing seeing before you become stagnant. Number two, competing against others. Now, I agree with competition. I'm not against competition. I agree that you should be competitive. I agree that you should compete against your competitors and be better. But the main focus in this area is not the competition, is not who you're going against. My thing, my competition that I'm talking about is individual, which is becoming the best you that you can. The best you to improve yourself. This is where I'm at. Now, the person who you're going to be competing against is not your neighbor. The person that you should be competing against is yourself. Who were you last year to who are you now? And how you can improve yourself to become better. So many circumstances, we face this problem of being competitive against the person who's next to us. But the real truth and the fact is, is that we're not competing against them. Because if we compete against them, we're just going to sit at the level that for us, the people you're competing against is the highest. And that may not be your highest that you want to compete. You can probably go even more, but because you're stuck in the area of competition of where you are at. So instead of you closing your, your limit line to right here where everybody else is competing, and as you improve yourself, you're gonna rise above them because you're improving yourself and not just facing what everybody else is going with, but you're improving yourself then and you're improving yourself after, which means that you're improving yourself when everybody's having a hard time, but you're focusing on yourself. So that means that you're gonna find more things that you need improvement, and by the time you know it, you'll be up here while everybody will be down here trying to still compete against each other. And trust me, look at this, everybody's competing and you're rising by yourself, 
becoming the best you that you can. So wherever you're at in this moment, I challenge you, take this first tip of facing your year. So guys, I hope this video has helped you out. I hope that this first tip was awesome and you're excited about it as much as I am. So guys, try this tip out and if it helped you, let me know through the comments. Be sure to like my channel and subscribe and for sure, share this channel with everybody that you know because I think the more we can help each other, the more we can improve and become better, guys. So thank you for watching. This is John Jimenez. And like always, guys, you're the best at what you do and have a great day.